New Hope, Ohio. What an idyllic name for the hustle and bustle of this ghost town. The U.S. Post Office left here over 120 years ago, but somehow New Hope holds on. And what a history! The stagecoach stop and brothel, erected in the 1840s, offered the ultimate in travel luxuries. Well, so the rumor goes. And I'm happy to report it's still a cat house to this very day. Ooh. Did I mention that New Hope has one of the largest feral cat populations in the state of Ohio? People drive for miles around to drop off their cats here. Oh, it's wrong. And fighting this injustice is New Hope's Catwoman, a superhero trying single-handedly to spay, neuter, and care for as many cats as she can. While she itches and wheezes and sneezes... You see, this cat woman is allergic to cats. Well, a woman allergic to cats saving a bunch of cats is this. Um, even though I'm very allergic to cats, um, I do love cats. Um, and I, I love all animals, unfortunately, to a fault, even wildlife. So the the part about it is they were mul- they multiply worse than rabbits, if, and many people understand how cats work. And uh, they're smart little critters too. They will, uh, they'll call in, you know, they find a place where there's food, water, and shelter. They, the word gets around the neighborhood. And I end up with other strays. And uh, unfortunately, um, people also like to dump them. And they seem to look at my place and think, hey, this is a great place. Well, and I'm already way outnumbered, but. Beverly used $400 of her pure heart money to help this allergic superhero care for the cats of New Hope. Animals, they, so many people, they don't want cats. They view cats as throwaway animals uh, and, they, and they get rid of them. They, they dump them and it's really changed my heart because I come to realize, you know, those little guys, they didn't ask to be there. Um, you know, they ended up there and they just want to be loved and they want shelter and they want food and water just like anything else. They're just trying to survive. So it's not their fault. It's not their fault that they're there. So I try to do the best that I can. The Catwoman of New Hope, Ohio. She's not letting itchy eyes, wheezing, or hives get in the way of doing the right thing. Maybe we could all learn a little bit from her heroic ways. Good luck, Catwoman.